Hey, what's up, guys? This is Captain Travis with Don Chico Charters in Cancun, Mexico. Uh, most likely, if you're receiving this, you had reached out asking for a quote or for some information. So um, I just wanted to uh, share the best way to give you uh, the most value uh, as possible and share uh, all the pricing and information that you could uh, possibly possibly be wanting uh, when booking a fishing charter down here in Cancun. And this is probably the most easy way to explain it all. So uh, we'll dive right in and get started. So I will send you a link, uh, which will take you to the home page of my website. Um, and if you just scroll down, um, you can see all the different uh, charters that we offer, fishing, yacht, catamaran, and then other tours. Most likely you're wanting to know about uh, some fishing charters. So we'll go ahead and click on the fishing charters button there. And that'll take you to the page uh, that has all the different boat options. So uh, people always ask me, which boat do I recommend? That's probably one of the most frequently uh, asked questions I get. So um, I recommend every boat. It just depends on uh, the amount of people that you have and your budget. Um, here, you know, I have how to choose a perfect boat. Uh, basically all the boats fish the same, uh, style and techniques and they go to the same spots. Um, and it just comes down to the, the size of your group and the budget. Um, all of my boats have great captains and crews. Uh, I would not be, um, having them on my website if they, uh, if they didn't meet my standards, uh, which are pretty high. So they all catch fish and they all treat my customers just right. Um, so you can just kind of scroll through and see which boat, uh, you'd most likely be interested in. Um, and once you find a boat, then you just click the learn more button. Then I'll take you to another page that has some more info, uh, with pricing. So you'll see the, <clears throat> the pricing options for the four hour, six hour, eight hour, 10 hour. And a lot of people always ask, uh, if, is it per person pricing? Is it per person or, uh, and the answer is no, it is, uh, this is the base rate. So for example, a four hour trip for one up to six people would be $700. Uh, the only additional fee would be the $15 dock fee per person. So if you had two people, uh, for four hours, it would be the 700 plus the $15 dock fee per person. So it'd be $730. That would be your price. Um, so you can scroll down on all the boats and you can kind of see some information about the captain and crew and additional information about what's included. Uh, you can find the address and location. Uh, some of the boats do have some videos, so you can check out the videos. Um, there's a map on each, uh, if you scroll down to the bottom, there's a map location so you can see where they're located in relation to your hotel. Um, and there's a photo gallery so you can scroll through and check out the photos of the boats. Um, they're at the bottom of the page. Um, and uh, how do you make a reservation? So there is a book now button. If you can see that there, you go ahead and click that. My website and reservation system uh, has a real-time availability. So uh, anything with green, there is available time slots if it's green. So you can click any day that you're interested in. So if you wanted to go on August 1st, you would select your time slot there, 6 a.m. All These are all the different departure times. Um, so you would select 7 a.m., for example. Uh, if you're wanting four hours, you would just select one four-hour trip. You'd select number of passengers. And as you can see, it self-populates the, uh, the $15 per person dock fee. So it'd be an additional 30, as I had mentioned before. If you need transportation, you can select the transportation option and you can select or just enter your hotel there. And I will send you a quote uh, for transportation uh, later on. Uh, we do offer box lunches, so you can add a box lunch for $10 a person. Uh, 12 beers are included, but if you'd like to add additional beers, you can add it there. Um, here you can add any sp uh, special requests, um, whatever that may be. And if, uh, then you can select where you heard about us. And then we have the policies. Um, these are your cancellation policies, the refunds, deposits, um, so you just need to read through these and select them, uh, to be able to proceed with the checkout. 
And then it's just standard here, enter your contact info, credit card info, and you'll be paying just the deposit. Um, the remaining balance will be needed to be paid once you arrive to the dock. Um, if you're going to pay the balance with a credit card, there will be a 10% credit card processing fee. Uh, if you pay with cash, you can avoid that fee. Um, another important or another uh, page here that I'd like to show you guys uh, that you can kind of look through answers all the most frequently uh, asked questions that I always get, like which boat, which crew do you recommend, how to make a reservation, where you're located, transportation, what do you catch in this time of year, uh, so you can see the different seasons there, uh, what happens if there's bad weather, refund policies, uh, what does a typical uh, day of fishing look like with us, it's pretty detailed there. What do we need to bring? Just different recommendations. Um, also on the home page, if you scroll all the way down, you can see the different uh, species and the months. So sailfish, we got November through July, blackfin tuna, February through September, uh, mahi-mahi, marlin, wahoo, red snapper, black grouper, barracuda, amberjack, triggerfish. Those are some of the most common species we get here. So um, so all the information is there. Pricing, location, what are we catching, availability. Like I said, we have real-time availability. So you can just book, book with confidence. Uh, once you make a reservation, you will get an automated uh, email confirmation with your remaining balances. It'll have a Google Map link to the location. Um, and then if you need transportation, uh, I'll just let me know um, and I will get you a quote for that. Uh, so, and also, as you can see here, we do offer some other stuff like scuba diving. Uh, we got all different packages for scuba diving. We have some other tours here, some interesting kind of fun stuff for the family. Uh, this is a sub wing. This is pretty cool. If you scroll down, you can watch a video about that. Um, and let's see what else. Um, Chichen Itza. We do some like kind of boat tours to to Isla Mujeres, uh, which is kind of fun for the family with snorkeling and stuff. So um, lots of different options. There's even some parasailing, jet ski, all that. Uh, and transportation, we do any kind of transportation that you might need, airport transportation or any transportation for your excursions. So you can just click one of these options here in the transportation. Um, there's kind of a price pricing estimate on, on the pricing and uh, you would just need to fill out this form uh, to request transportation. And I'll get back with you on a quote and you can let me know if you want to proceed. Uh, there is some pros and cons with uh, transportation. Um, but you know, uh, it's all when you, whenever you're hiring private outside transportation, for example, with me, it's going to be a little bit more expensive. Um, uh, but you know, the, the pros and the benefits to that is the, my driver is, he works with me every day. He knows exactly where to take you and he knows the boat. He knows the captain. So he's familiar. Uh, but for that, it's going to be a little bit extra as opposed to just getting a taxi. The taxis, uh, sometimes they don't know where they're going. Um, and it can be, it can be a little bit of a hassle, uh, but it is cheaper. So, uh, either way is fine. As long as you make it to the boat on time, uh, it's good with me. But, uh, other than that, that's really about it. Uh, you can message me through, uh, Facebook, Instagram, email, uh, phone call, or you can uh, just hit this message Captain Travis button there, and that'll uh, just take you to a form. You can message me, message me there with any questions that you might have. Uh, but other than that, that's about it. Um, I hope I covered pretty much everything. Um, but, yeah, just let me know if you have any other questions, and we look forward to hearing from you. Thanks so much.